Randy Lou here bringing you more action from this Triton Super High Roller Series cash game. No Limit Hold'em is the game and we are playing the stand-up game. That's a 3k penalty to each player, totaling 21,000. And previously, Jason Kuhn lost the first stand-up game that he's ever played. Here's a new round. Seven? Yes. Phil Nagy keeping things aggressive, pre-flop and loose, 4-3 suited. Linus did straddle of ace, king, brewer, king, queen offsuit in the small blind. Baldy. Going to attack Phil Nagy's open. Patrick now, a pretty hand. Wisely gets away, saves them some money. Sixty. Sixty thousand. Going upstairs to sixty k. I'd like my do over. Tilt straddle. Four? I lost 7,000. <laughs> okay, I have a straddle for you. Uh, Look at that. Okay. She's helping me get rid of my tilt. <laughs> okay. I appreciate you. 4,000. A double straddle from Vivian. Right, 16,000. Aaron's gonna take out some money. <laughs> Aaron Zhang looking to take their money, she says. 6 4 suited, attacking Chris Burr, King Queen once again. One time. <laughs> Nagy laying down the ace 10 offsuit with the double straddle on. Open in a straight draw here for Aaron Zhang. The bottom end. We'll check. It is the type of texture that you tend to check a lot of your range on this board. We're debating whether to attack here of King Queen. Feels as opponent is rather weak to a snappy call. Comes the three. To see Aaron Zhang quickly call so fast, he might actually think that Aaron Zhang has gone some kind of showdown value type hand that's pot controlling, check through on the turn. Ace now, Aaron Zhang. Linus, are you leaving tomorrow? Tomorrow morning, yeah. Last chance to take my money. <laughs> I don't want to take your money. I just want to meet you. <laughs> it's not really all it's cracked up to be. Yeah, it's hard. Me meeting him, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> A milky looking bet here. Oh, Nicely done. 6-4 suited. Ooh. What is that? 6 high. 6 Ooh. high. Crisper thinking about those king queens he just played. Yeah. Got a regular straddle in this pot.
что? Antoni is trying to use the power position and that dealer button. 10k is the raise. Vin calls pre-flop. Heads up to the flop. King King 3 Rainbow, all Vivian. Vivian leads 6k into this pot, a board that absolutely smashes her and is perceived to not really have a leading range here. Trying to deceive Patrick Antonius who takes the bait and floats of just 10-8 high. Turn card is the 9, brings in straight draws and flush draw potential. Didn't you? Yeah. You bet 3k? Isn't this a 5k chip? Yeah. 6k. You bet 6k. Okay. Check. And Vivian checks now with the game plan, expecting floats. Okay, room pitch. It's just breaking my brain, yeah, bro. Yeah. It was you 500 yesterday, right? It's crazy. It just came from the poker room. It's oh. 500. Oh, uh, yeah. One hour ago. One or two hours ago, right? Oh, these are six. Yes, okay. 15. Patrick with the follow through. Listen, congratulations you. You are the first to have five times. Oh, yeah, thanks, title. man. Yeah, that was dope. Yeah. Thank you. So next time your face will be, will be there? <laughs> Everyone has to wear a mask with my face on it. <laughs> Why are they talking? <laughs> oh, oh, no block. Oh, good for you. were the first one, no block. <laughs> it's like they're all obsessed. <laughs> well, Vivian wasn't bluffing, but she did extract a lot of value. I got bluffed so hard, so many times. <laughs> they keep, they try, they tried so many times. So when I called, it's like I did not expect. It's what a beautiful man does to beautiful women, you know? He just, Asian he women, there's them nothing and like them Asian women in poker. <laughs> <laughs> no one will bluff you. You go all in one million with only one pair is. <laughs> and flush draw. <laughs> and a flush. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nagy feels that he's kissing that chip goodbye. We'll see though. It's a six way flop, A752 clubs. Linus Lolliger with the best of it, top pair, no kicker. Thank you. Gonna check it through to the nine. For me? Can you bring me a change, please? Can you change it? Well, Linus is distracted. Does let Phil Nagy get there with the six. He actually has a better straight than Patrick Antonius as he's holding the 10 to couple with it. Just 2K. It might entice Patrick Antonius to raise here. What's the rule on the split pot in this game? Uh, it's no, no one gets a no card. Mm -hmm. 
Anybody six? No, six. Six. Oh, you got six cents. That's my money. Holy shit. Six Super cents. straight, bro. Oh, okay. Wow. Whoa. There's no chop. <laughs> no chop. No Take chop. I thought you were going to try to buff me off a chop, and I was like, go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was thinking of it. <laughs> you should have thought harder. And I thought, nah, you never have Sick anything, one. so I win with Sick the same. Sick one to ask Jack Tenement. Sick one to ask after you have all that chops. <laughs> Even when you're wrong, you're right. It must be nice to be Antonius. Hey, what's up, bro? What's up? Well, I'm not sure if Nagy noticed, but when he kissed those chips goodbye, he actually got a nice ROI on that return. Preflop ranges are getting loose with these limps so far. Line is gonna punish her. King Queen suited, 7k. You sit or stand there? Hmm? You sit He's or stand? He's the first one who sit. Good games. Thank you. It's a fun game. Yeah, it's a fun game, man. Check. I think you favor yeah. short deck players. <laughs> Big time. Linus checking back. The flush draw two over. It's hits yep. top pair. All notes yeah. matched. Yeah. <laughs> Eleven. Linus looking to extract value from all the pair straight draw type hands. Of course, weaker top pairs. This 500 that's just sitting there. Is it someone's change or? Is it just... Okay. Okay. Patrick does make the call here. 14% does not hit. Pairs the nine. It's just not the real world. There's 500 just sitting there. <laughs> Yeah. What do you mean it's just green? What's no, playing? It's white it's chip, blue chip, red chip, okay, green chip. Yeah. Mean, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> know, it's just so surreal. One red, two red. 30? We have 30,000. Linus correctly deduces that this queen with the king kicker is worthy of a value bet. Expects Patrick and Tony's, of course, to raise ace queen pre flop. So we're going to cut that out of the range. Specs like to hear from the Jack Tens earlier. The sets. Really, his main concern is 9x, but he probably feels that Patrick, at some frequency, would lead the river if he did hit trip nines. For Patrick, though, a bit confusing as why Linus isn't scared of the 9x right now. Patrick also is thinking that the chance of Linus having 9x is decreased dramatically. Which one? <laughs> Which one do you have? Ace king, ace queen, or king queen? He's right on. It's a good bet. You can play a little bit of play. I just want to see it. King Queen. King Queen. 
The good king queen. The good queen queen, yeah. Was a good read from Patrick, just couldn't follow through with the fold. Little limpy here for Crisper, King Four of Hearts. Patrick picks up Ace King right behind him. Perhaps he can pick up some of those chips he just gave to Linus Lulliger. Gonna size up, it seems, the 14k. The number of cards remaining has been reduced drastically, so you'll see players go for bigger sizings looking to take it down. Let's see if Brewer decides to take a flop here. He is a big sizing out of position, but he might feel that the big sizing is a bit polarized. Looks like he is going to take a stance against Patrick. Trying to win a card himself. 5 3 3 2 diamonds. Patrick with the best hand ace king backdoor diamonds for him. But for Chris Burr, bit of a three liner, right? The 3 4 5 in his hand working. The backdoor hearts. The king over card, which he perceives to be good sometimes. 15k C bet from Patrick. And Chris Brewer is going to check raise here. Just feels that Patrick, if he's unpaired, can't really continue. And if he does get called, lots of turn cards, he can shovel a lot of chips in there. Whether it's like a six, a deuce, a heart. Can Patrick read into this? Just the 5-3-3 texture is so dry. He probably feels if Chris Brewer was holding a three somehow All in. or a boat that he would just check call. Nice shove from Patrick Antonius. Nicely done. Little googly eyed there from Chris Brewer. Well played. Is that a value bluff? Uh, I want a sixth play, I think. Yeah. <laughs> I want a card. Mm, it I want can the be pot. anything. <laughs> End up game. Can be anything. I'm trying to learn and teach the audience. Damn it. Oh. Chris Brewer continues to limp, trying to get involved in as many pots as he can, trying to win a card, paying the minimum, but they keep raising him pre-flop, ace-jack for Linus. Jason Kuhn needs a card, he calls King-8 offsuit. Queen high board, no connection for all three players. 
Lan is gonna check as the preflop razor. Looks like Jason Kuhn is gonna attack here. He feels that he can represent the queen pretty well with a flat calling range. Twenty-two. Race twenty-two. Wow! Check raise of twenty-two k. Strong. Nicely done, Linus Lulliger. It's almost like you've played this game before. Not how? Not actually. That extra rules. Gotcha. <laughs> Small, slight variation. Only one still. Throw that ace jack over to Patrick, one seat over. Jason Kuhn, 7-5 suited, looking to pick up a pot he's been getting involved in a lot lately. Anson Yuzin. King 3-3 three, three rainbow, a very dry texture. Does Jason want to see bet this board? He does not. Feels that he see bets here. His frequency will be too high on this board. It's going to give Anson Yu the chance to take this pot down, 12k. Patrick, not a believer, makes the call of just ace jack high. Up to after this. Back home, Vienna. Holiday is over. I've never been to Vienna. I got a buddy that uh, that lives out that's out in Vienna. But, uh, he's invited me a bunch of times, and I just haven't had the opportunity to get out. There. Never been? No. It's a beautiful city. Yeah, I gotta get the. Architecture there is amazing. Yeah. My wife's always wanted to go. And, uh, my buddy's got two vineyards, and he's just you know, <laughs> with that much, with that much wine and, and, and good yeah. friends. I mean, what, what could be bad? Exactly. The wine there is amazing. Yeah, that's, that's what I hear. So Anson Yu bets again, ace eight offsuit on a five, which appears to be a brick. Funny, is it? Is there, is there a market for, is there a good market for wine in Costa Rica? <laughs> and, and I says, well, you know what? I don't know, but I think it would be cool if I were to import wine. <laughs> so, yeah. so, Red I mean, wine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so I have a, a store down in the free zone down in Panama, so you can start having them send me send me the wine down in, in Panama, and I'm going to be the only so importer made it of happen. his wine. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the coconut you can leave. Put down, yeah. Distribution so we can tell them. Thank you. But long run, much, this yeah. is a very good thing. That's great. Thank you. I'll buy, I'll, I'll buy enough to keep you yeah. in business. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I believe that. <laughs> so. Jason Kuhn's been having trouble winning a pot. Perhaps the distribution will get better for him later in this game. You crushed me.
I don't know if I've ever seen you in such a good mood. Ah, he loves the game. <laughs> Ah, well, he loves this game. <laughs> it's, just a, it's just a nice little change to play well, some stand-up games. Well. Did anybody fall? <laughs> I just got blocked. Can you just put it's, nice. It's, it's nice to get sometimes blocked. <laughs> Check. Check. Yeah, Check. Check. Crisper with the best hand, trip aces. Checks around to the eight of clubs on the turn, which gives Patrick Antonius aces and eights, but it's no good. Four thousand. Crisper trying to extract value from the eight X's. The little clubs and diamonds out there too. Patrick priced in for now. River card is the queen. And Chris Burr is aware that Patrick knows that he wants to win the card, so he might be able to price in a way that Patrick is forced to call. Seven. Does keep it small for 7k bet. Patrick aware of the dynamic. Makes the call. And with that pot, Jason Kuhn going to have to pay out another 21k. Two rounds of stand-up game he's played. First ever for him. That's a 42k total punishment for him. Oh. And the stand-up game can be a real fun game, but when it's not going your way, it's quite, quite frustrating, to say the least. These sets keep getting cooler. <laughs> yeah, they're doing a good job. Any big winners want to give me some some change of some sort? Yeah, yeah this I'm set is pretty pair. amazing. Next next time around, I'm gonna make a pair. You were in Cyprus too, right? So I did have eights, pocket eights, one on the line of the best one. Eights. With the little Other rail that, tables. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the rail tables and the, and the, and the bleachers bucks, and everything. It was TV on bad. top, yeah. or even rail yeah. on the TV. I it was, that was a lot great. Of really good hands. But it's that was my favorite. Yeah, I, mean, yeah. I like the, it's, it's, I just, I like the <laughs> moving I stuff. Yet to have this is cool, but yeah, you're right. It's, when I think about it, the, the, with the bleachers and everything, it was really cool because you were hard way that you could talk about what was going on. You weren't bothering people. Exactly. Yeah, perfect. Plus, I, you got to see a lot more flops than normal. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> no, this game's a great idea. Straight up to thousand? People yeah. are going to lose a lot of money. Are we allowed to rebuy in the game or no? I don't see why not. Yeah, play as deep okay. as you want, man. Just asking. No, I was just asking. Six thousand points. Anson, you gonna open up two kings? Crisper, Jack ten suited. Getting busy here. Linus has seen Crisper a three bet several times already with some folds. Does he think these two nines is good enough to attack? 55? He does, 55k. Bad timing though, as Anson's got two kings. <laughs> That's why I'm not straddling this time. Waste some of my money. 
pretty much a dream scenario here. It cost me the least amount of pain. <laughs> Owen? Can I swing? Yeah. That count, please. One. Just about One 90k more. Or something. Can't feel good for Linus. Knows his opponent's got a strong hand. You guys still playing short thing? Priced in the call. The call. Seems like Linus felt there's enough ace kings in his opponent's range, which is definitely true. <laughs> Once or twice. It's up to you. Make it I twice. Don't care. It's up to you. Twice? Go. And the first one, twice? first one counts okay. for the stand-up game, yeah. right? The first board the first counts. The first board. Okay. Win a card. The first board counts yeah. for this. Linus picks up some outs with the gut shot. Okay, sip on some coconut. Coconut run good. Win the first one. Didn't even waste any of your sad outs either. <laughs> yeah. I should have played the shoulder. I could have got in there on this one. Yeah. <laughs> Pop it up. Odd choice by Linus. The pot and win the cart. <laughs> I cannot complain. Did not sip on the coconut twice. So he'll have to settle for a chop. You did see the dealer pass Linus. Lollager a card there for winning the first board. That was not how I wanted that to go. I wanted to call, I wanted to see a king queen nine flop. There we go. Pair of sixes here for Vivian. Okay. Start things off with 3k. One brutal thing about this game is it doesn't ever let you take a leak. I guess you have to win a hand to go use the bathroom. <laughs> that's when you. That's when someone gets real wild. Like, I do. I managed to take a piss for, for two hours. Yeah. But actually, we were we playing the stand-up game where like games. one seat that we, where one seat got dealt out because we didn't want to play nine-handed. We were playing eight-handed. So like, yeah. so like, if you didn't have a card and there was like only two other people, it's, or it's one other person or something, it was just brutal. Check. But you could go to the bathroom. So Nagy yeah, does have the best hand, Jack eight. Vivian C bets eight K. So I gotta stop losing pots from the straddle. Antonius looking for a four. <laughs> you haven't gotten to win a pot yet, so. <laughs> Yeah, I'm over. <laughs> well, he gets out of it. So Vivian picks up outs in the form of a straight draw. Nagy's still best of Jack Eight. That is an action card as Vivian makes the straight and Patrick makes the wheel. It is a four-liner. 
But Vivian did raise from under the gun, so her 6x should be perceived to be a lot less in frequency. An 8k bet. Looks a bit blockery. Patrick Antonius, a misstep, raises the 52k. Patrick feeling that Vivian is on a blocker bet here. And that Vivian would size up if she was holding a 6x. However, Vivian has sized it perfectly once again against Patrick. Vivian gonna re-rip it all in of course with the straight. The one move that Patrick didn't want to see was the re-raise. It is very possible for Patrick to have the six himself. Very tough huh? So does he need to call with just the three? Well, ace three, I mean. Patrick doesn't seem convinced. Trying to walk through the hand, break down the ranges and positions. So I just called. <laughs> he's gonna get aces while he's in the bathroom. <laughs> so make cool. sure you put, make like sure you put his King's cards on the, on the thing. So that, <laughs> make sure you put his cards on the thing. So that yeah, they no, see we can it. wait for him. Huh. Just to be honest, really have pocket sixes or a six of hearts? A six of hearts or pocket sixes? How do you find a play with anything else than that? 
anything else. It's ridiculous. Stupid hand. Just I mean, if you get luck like this, it's just a really good play. Just a really good six. play. And the bluff. Well, Patrick's figured it out. You're not the same Asian girl that I'm used to play with. <laughs> <laughs> Very strong. <laughs> Very strong player. I'm so lucky today. I don't need to bluff. I am at a straight. I had a straight too. <laughs> this is the smaller one. Patrick Antonius gets the pocket sixes. Jason Kuhn looking to win the pot as he has not won a hand ever since we started playing the stand-up game. Will be tough for him as Phil Nagy picks up ace queen and bumps it up to 18-5. Kuhn's out. Who has cards on this table? Anybody? There's one card, Minus two cards, two video. cards. Patrick gonna make the call here. I gotta give you action. I like it. There's so much dickery going on right now. This is sick. I appreciate you. Nagy makes top pair queen kicker. I'm about to add some too. Meanwhile, I keep talking shit, just paying everyone 21,000 every, every two orbits. I'm just like, there's 21,000. I'll keep waiting for aces, I guess. Then Jack, King, Queen, Ace. Ace. Ten. No, 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 no. no. Oh. You want to sit what down. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> oh, sneaky. I forgot about the card. Uh, we should, yeah, we shouldn't change. have said anything. Yeah, I know. Mock the hands. That so would have been funny. Car. Makes good TV. That's the Shulk play. And then he loses, if he loses the game. It gets real funny. That would have been super funny. <laughs> but it didn't happen. It might happen to you. I think I'll remember the show. I'm going to be honest. We'll see. <laughs> what, you going to try to... <laughs> I don't know, I feel, like I'd have to, I feel like I'd have to play a really big pot to forget to show. I need to play like some 700k pot and then and it's like the false Can I get some chips? Hand. No, I'm just kidding. I'm joking. I need to get some chips too. <laughs> oh, I gotta get like a five way all in. That'd be fun. Aaron saying ace eight offsuit up front. King five of clubs comes along. Mm, I could leisurely stroll to the bathroom. What did you say? I said I could leisurely stroll to the bathroom. <laughs> Sorry. No, you can. Yeah. Not that expensive. <laughs> Jason Kuhn makes the best hand and checks around the queen now. Perhaps he'll win this one finally. Never mind. 
Wheel on the board. Aaron Zhang makes the best hand. Safe. Take the card is very important. <laughs> Safe. <laughs> very easy. <laughs> check, check, check. <laughs> Yeah, this strategy. <laughs> you take the card first. Very safe. <laughs> and that's a wrap.